Before we get into the video, guys, as you know, we're on the race to be the second Rocket League YouTuber to reach a million subscribers. And in my case, I'd be the first pro player to reach a million subs, which would be a ridiculous achievement. If you guys want to help me along that road to 1 million subscribers, you could definitely do that. If you're one of the 45.6% of people that are watching my videos who are currently not subscribed and you do enjoy my content, please show me some love by pressing that subscribe button and press the bell as well. Show us notified when I upload a brand new video. Hope you guys enjoy the video for today. I appreciate y'all. You guys are the absolute best. Yo, what's up guys? In the last video, we finished off at Diamond 2 Division 3 at 956 MMR. So we're getting closer and closer to Diamond 3. Hopefully, we can get ourselves two wins for today. Let's get into the games and hopefully we don't accidentally score any more goals. Let's go. All right, this is a pretty even lobby. Everyone in here is around mid 900 MMR. Not too bad at all. We got two PS4 players on the other team. Some of the pings are a little bit high, but outside of that, looking pretty even. I hit this downfield, off the corner, should bounce middle. See what my teammates gonna do. Nice aerial, close. I'm gonna go for the demo here. Got a bump as well. I think that's a good play to make as well, so that I can't really go for the ball. Just go for the player, you know what I mean? <laughs> Opens up the net if someone's gonna be ready to come in. Nice pressure. Okay, I got a way back here. That guy is closer than me. So on defense, if you are last back in threes, you're trying to kill time for your team. Create a chance for them to move forward. My team is going to be waiting on me here. I'm not going to go though. Falls over my head. It's my cue to just back off at that point. Nice. Try this place forward again. I don't want to get a shot on target, so just trying to play it around them. We back here. Trying to support my team. They're both in front of me. I have vision of both, so I don't want to over aggress on this. It's not worth it. This guy's gonna go first. And there's no reason for me to push forward because my teammates already rotated out. So we can just gather boost and go forward again. We don't need to force a player that is never going to turn into anything. Nice. Teammate should go, but I think he's waiting on me. I'll let him go for that. Okay, I hit off the backboard. I killed one as well. A little bit of a late follow up, but it was a good try. Problem is if I have players that are trying to play really passive as well, then it's kind of tough for this idea to work out. <laughs> I'll play this off the corner. I should go middle. Good play from there. My teammate's really far back in goal. I think he was AFK actually. Touches up. Get a follow up touch. Gets my teammate up. Everyone. Should go middle. I'll rotate all the way back here. No one's back on our team yet, so might as well. I can play this to the right side. I'm gonna go again. Let's play it to their corner, because I know that they're gonna have a free ball. I don't want that. One of my teammates is playing full-time goalie, it seems like. I'm gonna try to go back so that he leaves. Dude, these games feel very hit or miss, though, in terms of what we're gonna get teammate-wise. Cause obviously they don't know they don't know that I'm not gonna score, but I don't wanna have that in my name. I have seen that recommendation in comments, but I don't really want that in my name. I want it to be organic. Oh he's lagging. No problem. Still trusted him. Alright, let's make a play downfield here. Nice. Okay, I can play this. Unlucky. 50 50 my teammate. I was gonna play out the corner. Teammate would be able to go in. That's actually a good pass middle. But yeah, my teammate's playing super passive because he's lagging. So this is gonna be down to my other teammate being able to score. I gotta open up some plays here. The demo or something. Play it to the side. Oh, that's my teammate. That's good. I trust my teammate. Nice. He's gonna beat me. Alright, we're good. Okay, put it around two. Just gonna pop this ball up now. Teammates are really far back. Feels like. 
Going for the fake. Let's see what he does. That's fine. It's actually good. Round one. Pass to my teammate. One more. Close. Again, we're pretty much 2 v 3 Because our teammate's just lagging on all the way back in defense. Try to hit this down middle. I'll turn again. Play middle again. Teammate should turn. Yeah, he's already full-time defense. Dude, this is so hard. I'm unlucky as hell. Totally. Hopefully he misses. Killed one. Oh, I wish, dude. I really do wish. Made this off the backboard. Nice. Let's go, dude. Played it off the back. There's no one left. All I see is finish it off. Nicely done. And I bumped the last guy that could have saved it. The only guy that could have saved it got taken out of the play. Good job. All around. That was a really tough one to win. Considering our teammate couldn't really play for most of it. It was mostly a 2v3. But he was he was going for the ball he needed to, which is good. And that got us up to Diamond 3 Division 2 off that. Let's go. Getting closer and closer to the champ. We're 987 MMR, so 1K isn't exactly Diamond 3, huh? I thought it was. But anyway, let's get into the next one. Last game of the video. Hopefully, we can get ourselves another win and get ourselves into 1K MMR. Let's go. All right, for the last game, we're playing against a dude that was on my team in the first game. And we got ourselves two console players this time. Hopefully, they're absolutely nuts. I'm going to say defending so he knows to go. Let's just chill back here. I know my teammates... I know my teammate from the last game was, was good, so I have to be careful for him. So over one. I'm not going to go for this one again. I'm just going to leave it. Teammates both really far back, but good challenge. I should be behind them here, so I can follow up whatever happens. I beat him to it. Play off the wall. Oh my god, don't go in. Okay, we're good. My worst fear is scoring more of those by accident. Over one. Uh, teammates should let me go there. Like, if I'm still following the ball, you going is going to do absolutely nothing different than what I would do. If anything, it's going to make my challenge even worse. Definitely just trust your teammate in that sense. And let them go. Challenge. Played around two of them. Now that I have a touch here, and I'll play it middle off that. Good shot. Well done, dude. Really good shot. Again, he was there first. Let, let him have a touch first. And then I'll just make a touch to go middle. You don't want to throw yourself out of the play for a bad 50 50 or a 50 that's not even going to be controlled. You have no idea where it's going to go. Just let them have the touch first, play off of it, and uh, make a play going forward from there. That's what we did. That was a good shot to finish it off for my teammate. Oh, that was bad. Alright, that was my fault. I was trying to get a pinch. I mistimed it. A pinch that doesn't go toward the net, which is why I kind of hesitated. Teammate, close. Again, all we really gotta do is play good defense at this point. And defending in threes is all about just choosing the right balls to go for. Like, that ball's a good one to go for, because I know someone's gonna go, I could take one out of the play, and then it's gonna be over another one's head. If I get it fast enough. Here, I'm last back for a while, so I don't want to over-aggress this ball. I'll let my teammate help me out. There we go. That was really easily. Teammates behind me. I know I have a, a safety net if I miss, and I could just bang one. Teammate should go. I trust he's going to hit this. Nice. The main thing about playing defense is just, in threes is just about, like, knowing when your team's going to be able to help you. And if they can't help you, try to kill time until they can't, pretty much. It's the main main thing. Like here, I'm alone for a long time, right? So I'm trying to play it in a way that I still have control over the play, even if it is dangerous. Like right there, I had to go in front of my goal, but I knew that regardless, I had a 50. Like I would have the opportunity covered. 
Let's play impatient again. Play that middle, off the wall. I'm gonna hit this off our own corner, or off our wall to go into the other corner, I mean. I'll try to just play patient on this. They can't do anything with that ball. If you're being realistic, they're not gonna have a really good shot from that corner like that. I'm gonna go up to the wall here. I can't go, so I'm gonna go back. My teammate missed. Let's like take this. Bump that guy and I can leave now. My play going forward is done. And there's two of my teammates up already, so I don't wanna overdo my stay there. I'm gonna go for this, cut out the pass. Nice. Got the back left boost as well. We can hold this down for a minute. Got him to give us the ball. Good job for my teammate to leave that for me. I can take mid boost. I'll just back off here because he's probably going to have a touch going forward. Could go for this, but I'm going to play passive. My teammate's up again. This is my ball to go for. My teammate's waiting. I played off the corner. I'll just do that there. If anything, I'll hit it back down to my teammate. There's really no danger. I could turn again. I save my boost so I can get back. I still have boost to follow up on the next touch. Good job. Play off the corner again. That's actually straight in. Nice. I'm gonna go all the way back here, just to make sure that we can get any kind of big clear that might come off the backboard. Good job, my teammate. He's there as well, so I'll wait middle. I'm just playing in support. They're not rotating back, but they don't really need to rotate back because there's a bunch of chances that are coming through here. I'm gonna fake this, go for the boost, leave it for my teammate. I got the boost and gave my team the ball as well for doing absolutely nothing there. Off the backboard. Could be a shootable chance. Teammates weren't quite ready, but again, all I gotta do is play passive here. We have the game secured. This is definitely awkward, but I can touch. Put myself in a spot that was pretty bad there. But regardless, we got out of it. Didn't score a goal. That's what we needed to do. Played good defense, solid all around. Got up to 1K MMR off of that. So we get closer and closer to the champ ranks. We got to Diamond 3, Division 3. Pretty solid all around. We finish off the video at 1017 MMR. In the next one, if we do get two wins, that should bring us up to champ 1 which is nuts. That means the series is almost done already. So it's pretty solid all around. But yeah, hope you guys have been enjoying. Have yourself a wonderful day or night, whatever time it is when you're watching this video. I appreciate y'all. The support has been absolutely insane. Thank you so much, guys. We're getting so close to 700,000 subs. Appreciate y'all. If you're not sub and you enjoyed the video, please go down, press that subscribe button, and help me on my way to 1 million. Appreciate y'all. I'll see y'all in the next. Peace.